this weather is so lovely. Bye. It's warm. Waiting for the luggage. Oh my gosh, hello palm trees. I've missed you. I don't eat fish anymore, but I know this is very traditional Portuguese. Oh, really too bad. I would have liked to try it. But this, this I can eat. Look at this chocolate cake. What is this madness? I need this in my life. One thing I've already noticed, Brazilian people, you are so beautiful, so pretty. That's a damn fine gym pool. And I look human again. I just got some breakfast. This is a wrap with zucchini and cheese and something, and also a green juice. Looking good. I have to admit, um, the tempo over here is a lot slower. Like even slower than in India. So I have a little bit, um, I need a minute to adjust. And checked in again for the domestic flight. It's going to be a little bit over an hour, but that's fine. And boarding for the third time in 24 hours. I must say it was quite okay. Hello. Obrigada. Sunscreen. I don't want any wrinkles, but it's really nice to be in warm weather. And we're just walking towards our airplane, which is over there. Boarding the plane. Our last flight, third flight in 24 hours. Seat 30B. I really hope there are like two seat aisles. I don't have to sit in the middle. And bringing in life, two seat aisles. <laughs> This is our hotel, the Payaguas Palace Hotel. Welcome to our room for the night. Let me just show you around. So you come in over here. Over there is the mini bar and some, I don't know, what's in this cupboard? Let's check it out. Oh, it's just a closet. And then we have two beds, two beds. We have to decide which one we're going to sleep. Um, the view is not spectacular, but we have light, which is good over here there's a small desk very cute by the way look at that and the bathroom let me see oh no of course not i have to put in the card yeah look at this oh hello let me just turn you around ah oh, that's a spacious bathroom man shower blow dryer nice I'm meeting Isabel in one hour and Julia from Julia from Germany is going to join us as well and then we're going to have lunch in this hotel. Afterwards we're going to explore the area so, but right now after 24 hours of travel I need a shower man. Look at this perfect outfit mirror. Oh my gosh. So this is what I'm wearing. This is a dress from Lofi's. These slippers are from Zara I guess. It's an old collection. And that's it, like really easy. I feel like a human being again. So this is what I ordered for lunch, just some simple vegetables and some sauteed potatoes because honestly, I need some good healthy food to keep me going today. We're just going for a stroll with the entire group. So everybody's here. Hi. <laughs> and 
Yeah, this weather is so lovely. I love it so much. It's not too hot. The humidity is all right. And Mato Grosso. This is no, no, no. This is mm, Cuyaba. 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 I keep forgetting the name of the city. Cuyaba. We are now in Cuyaba, in the province of Mato Grosso, right? Yeah. Yes. Got it right. Brazil, you rock already. Found the Batmobile in Brazil. What? This is so cute. And very cool, of course. Look at this cute little square. <laughs> and there's like a coconut vendor over here. And there's a Volkswagen, Volkswagen little truck over here. See that? This is really like I stepped into a movie. It's so cute. Another super cute square. So this is a church. Look at those clouds. It's so pretty and perfect. Just a cute little, well, it's actually like more like a park, a city park. And people are just chilling over there. Can you see the rainbow? We have three, two, one to spot it. And it's over here. It's so pretty. We just had a couple of drinks by the pool, but now I'm back in my room and I have like an hour and a half. Just chilling. I'm reading a new book. This one. It's something Chinese, but we'll see if it's any good. And I'm starting to feel the jet lag just teensy weensy a bit, but it should be all right. Whoopsie, I dozed off for a minute. Hello, jet lag. It's now, I think, almost like 1.30 a.m. in the Netherlands and over here it's 7. So uh, forgive me if I'm wrong, I, mean, I have no clue. But we're going to dinner and you know you can always wake me up for food. So no worries at all. Let's see. Yeah. So we're now at restaurant Varadero and it's honestly the most romantic place I've ever seen. Looks like we're going to have dinner in Jungle Book or something. Look at this beauty. It's so cute. Look at those little lanterns over there in the trees. Look at this. Oh my gosh. This is this is so Pinterest worthy. I think you might have to take a picture of just standing here. Yes, I will. Okay, let me take a picture. Yeah. Look at that. Look at those lanterns over there. So cute. It's a vintage barber chair. Now let's go inside. Because that's where we're going to sit. This is just amazing. Look at this. Look at that wall decoration. It's wood. Beto, tell us what this wonderful food is. Let me get this up in there. This is uh, tapioca. Tapioca with Brazilian cheese. But what is the name of the... What is the root. The name of the dish? The dish is dajin de tapioca. Can okay, you say that again? For the ladies. <laughs> <laughs> nice. And what does it mean? Translated in English? It is a uh, tapioca. It is uh, made by manioca. Sure. Yeah. And then they mix it with uh, cheese. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. and this is like this a pepper is, uh, jam. jam. Nice. Okay. Good to try it. So hot. Yes, it's the same thing. But now they mix with cheese. The cheese flavor kicks in later. It's very gooey on the inside. Yeah, I like it. It's a really good flavor. And I've never like tried a snack in this texture. It's good? You like it? You guys like it? It's good. I like it too. It's a fruit. And this is going to be my main course. As a vegetarian, we had two options. Either the fungi risotto or the pepe salad. This looks delicious. I'm happy with it. Alright, let me show you some bathroom goals. Hashtag goals. Look at this. It's so freaking cute. Look at that. And, and, it's not only cute, but they also have mouthwash, like a big family pack. And I'm definitely going to make selfies in this mirror. I'm back in the room and I'm happy to even be able to speak words. It's almost 10 p.m., which is 3 am in the netherlands and the jet lag is kicking in thank you so much for watching if you like this vlog put a thumbs up tomorrow we're going to pantanal so that's going to be a lot of fun 
if you're not yet subscribed to my channel i make daily travel vlogs like these and also i make a travel video on sa uh, saturday and a uh, road back to india series on sunday so if you would like to see more of my videos click that subscribe button and then i will see you soon bye oh my freaking gosh this is a big one this is a big one